Hey everyone, the name is Eric Dora and these are the 8 cognitive functions in real life situations. You can think about the 8 cognitive functions in this way. There are 4 types of introverts and 4 types of extroverts. Yeah, not every introvert is the same and not every extrovert is the same. Introverts can be divided into 4 groups, introverted intuitives, sensors, feelers and thinkers, extroverted sensors, intuitives, feelers and thinkers. Now, that means they extrovert different things or they introvert different things. So what do they introvert and what do they extrovert? Let's find out that in today's video. Introverted intuition is talking about why things are the way they are. Introverted intuition is a philosopher, a sage, somebody that likes to think about how things work and why they work the way they do. Introverted thinking types, they are people that like to list pros and cons. They like to analyze data. They like to compare and contrast things against one another to get a better understanding of how they work and how they could work differently. Introverted thinking likes to find ways to fine tune and optimize things. How do I get things to do what they are supposed to do as good as possible? Introverted feeling types enjoy listing and talking about things they enjoy. Introverted feeling types like being asked what their top 10 most favorite foods are or what their fa 5 favorite uh, destinations for travel could be. As an introverted feeling type it's important to talk about values, ethics and things that have to do with your own personality and self-expression. As an introverted sensing type you enjoy stability and discipline. You like low and calm and comfortable environments. You like when things are relaxing and easy. You like to have structure around you. You like to have a plan and you like to prepare in advance. You like thinking about a coming trip and what you need to pack. You like thinking about how much food you need to make and how much you're gonna need to cook and how many guests you'll have and how to make sure everyone has fun and a good time. Extroverted sensing types, they like intensity, richness and stimulation. They like being where everyone else is. They like being popular. They like the mainstream. They like being outgoing. Extroverted sensing types like talking and they like attention. They like being listened to and being seen and they like being on stage and performing. Extroverted thinking types like action, decision making and results. They like thinking about goals and projects. They're usually working on a project. They're usually doing something. They like to be busy. They like work. <laughs> they like feeling like they're making progress. They want to have a quick tempo about things and they like to get things done as fast as possible. Extroverted thinking types like results and are often competitive. They like to compare their own performance to the performance of other people and think about how they can get ahead. Extroverted feeling types like thinking about and finding similarities between themselves and other people. They like to connect with others and to build and establish relationships with the group and with the people around them. They like getting to know others and how they feel and what they value and what's important to them. And they like seeing what similarities they have with themselves and other people. They like building bridges, mediating and communicating with others. And they like just being able to feel that they have a shared bond or a shared goal together with others. Extroverted intuitives are usually the people that enjoy talking about possibilities and what ifs. In groups they usually think about multiple things that could be done and their head is often not in the present but in what could be. So they often have suggestions, ways to improve things and ways to do things differently. And often they enjoy acting and they like doing things in new ways. They like being original and they like trying new things. They're often at the newest restaurant or the newest place and they often like to hang out with and do things in an alternative or unusual manner. These are the eight cognitive functions. Let me know which one is your favorite and which one is the most difficult for you to identify. Thank you so much for watching and see you all in the next video.